Hi guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. Hi guys, welcome back to another video on my channel. For today's video, we're doing another vlog day in my life kind of thing. Today, I am just literally prepping to go to Korea. It is currently, it's like 9.40 in the morning. Usually I start my vlogs at like 7 or 8 a.m., but today has been a little bit crazy. Uh, hold on, let me just set y'all down so we can chat okay so basically today what happened was i was supposed to actually be traveling out of state today i was supposed to be picking up my cousin for she has a doctor's appointment in my state and so i was supposed to be doing that but actually there's a blizzard where she lives so i couldn't go so my brother is here because he's supposed to take care of the dogs but yeah i've just been literally packing all morning it's kind of been like a blessing in disguise to have my brother here because he's doing his work downstairs for his job and i am currently trying to figure out what the heck i'm doing with my life like i mentioned it currently is February 3rd, so that I leave March 5th. So I think I'm 30, I'm actually 30 days away today from leaving, which is kind of crazy. So this morning I've just been literally, not really packing, but just kind of like organizing my thoughts, organizing my stuff. And also, if you guys haven't seen, I downsized my K-pop collection. And so I've been going through my binders all morning, trying to figure out what the heck I'm doing. And like literally, I stopped at Treasure. When I got to Treasure, my brain broke. So I don't even know what I'm doing with all that stuff. But yeah, I've just been kind of just like organizing. I didn't even turn the camera on earlier because I didn't think I was gonna film. But then I was like, oh my God, I should film. Because later today, I actually have to bring my brother home and he lives far away. So I figured, oh, all the way back, we could do something that literally everybody has been asking me for. And that is more carpool karaoke. So yeah, I thought I would show you guys. Um, recently, I've been really loving this like new hairstyle. So I thought I'd show you guys like me putting on my makeup and my hair because I do kind of want to take an Instagram picture today because it's like snowing outside. So hopefully we can do that and then also I do have a package coming today That's really exciting so we can open it together and yeah, just another day in my life kind of crazy vlog prepping to move across the country uh, Prepping to move out of the country. I keep saying across the country, but yeah, it's like so crazy I forgot how much stuff you really need to prepare to like leave the country and it's just like so insane And I'm so stressed out. Also, if you guys are not on Twitter Skazoo dropped the plushies today and I was so angry because I don't have my Korean address yet. I won't get my address until like a week before I move in. So I can't pre-order my Skazoo plushies, but I can't send them to America because the shipping is too expensive. It's just... But anyways, all right. Let's put my makeup on. I'm feeling a little hideous right now. Not that like I look ugly without makeup, but like honestly, sometimes it just feels better to put your face on, have a good start to your day. I, I put on a real sweater. Yesterday, I did not get out of my sweatpants. So you guys, I'm just losing my mind here. I really want to leave the country. <laughs> uh, and I know I'm doing it soon. Okay, okay, here's time for hair. Also, if you can hear my brother literally playing the piano in the background, it's fine. Everything's fine. Anyway, so I saw this hair a few days ago on Instagram and I really loved it. And I tried it out the other day on a live stream and I also really loved it. So we're gonna do it again. It's the like the piggy tails with like the whatchamacallit with like the, the bubbles. I think it looks cool, you guys. I don't know. You guys have to let me know what you guys think. But first of all, I gotta brush the hair. Also, I am gonna get my hair done before I go to Korea. But I just don't know what to do, you guys. Should I? Comment down below. What do you guys think I should do? Should I just dye it blonde and have, like, a good base so that I can get it done in Korea, like, a few months after I go? Or should I dye it a color now and then get it touched up when I'm in Korea? What do you guys think? Also, I know it's, like, really bad. <laughs> My hair is in really bad condition right now. There's lots of, like, banding involved, so... I kind of want to get that, see if I can get some of that taken care of now and just do my roots and then just kind of be blonde before I go. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Also, this lighting is just trash. Okay, so basically what I do is I part my hair where I naturally part it. I don't know about y'all, but like I can't get down with the middle part. It just, it just, it kind of just makes me really upset. <laughs> so I'm just going to part it here and I don't really care if the back is even because honestly, I don't see the back of my head. So and neither does anybody else because I don't leave the house. So there's your tip of the day. You don't have to part the back of your hair. <laughs> okay. And then I use personally like teeny tiny clear elastics. I got these again when I was in Korea last time. I got them at Daiso. It was 300 for uh, 1,000 won. So it was really inexpensive. You can get them pretty much anywhere. But what I do is the first thing I do is I start to put my hair into a ponytail. I mean like a piggy tail back here. Just keep in mind wherever you put this side, you have to do the same on the other side. And I personally like to make sure that it's behind my ear just so that it's a little bit more like, I don't know, easy? I don't know. I don't know. Guys, I'm not a hairstylist. I don't know what I'm doing. Also, my hair is really, really, really thick. So these sometimes I break these little things. So just keep that in mind. Also, these aren't the best for your hair. So <laughs> also keep that in mind. I would get my hair caught in it. And then I kind of pull it like this. 
and that's where the first piggy will go and then I have to match it on the other side so like I said push it behind your ear and then kind of just I'm looking at my mirror sorry just kind of like play around with it see where it needs to be this one is kind of close to my ear about there I don't have to be exactly perfect the hairstyle will still look good but I just like to try and make them as even as possible but also one half of my head has more hair so I'll keep that in mind I feel like this elastic is gonna break okay so yeah and then I just pull this one as well I would say basically this one's a little bit low they're basically in the same spot but anyway I put them here and then now he's kind of the tricky part it's gonna it's gonna not make a lot of sense but basically what I do for those ones is I put them around three times but for the rest of them I don't put them around as many times so now is when you need to have kind of a lot of them and you decide where you're gonna have your bubbles I kind of make them about like I would say like maybe like two to three inch sections so what I'll do is I'll do this side first and then I'll do this side because for me it's a little bit easier and like I said I don't make them as tight as the other ones so yeah I wait like maybe like two to three inches and I'll put another hair bubble or hair elastic whatever y'all want to call it and I only put around two times and I'm not going to even touch it I'm not going to floof it right now and then I'll do the next one so obviously since I have really long hair I can have like a lot of these little things so I'll wait another section but if you guys have shorter hair like you can just do less sections basically so that's how my hair looks and then I'm not even gonna touch it yet but I'm gonna make sure that they're even on the same side so I'm gonna go to this side and I'm gonna say okay should be about here so that's where I'll put the next one now is when we'll make them look more like balloonies that's why I kind of said to make them a little bit looser what I do is I hold the elastic and I'll just pull it ever so slightly to kind of create like the bubble effect if that makes sense and then I'll stop that one and go to this one and again hold the elastic don't hold it too hard and don't pull too hard because if you pull too hard you're obviously gonna pull some of your hair out again I'm not a professional but this is just my experiences but you guys can see the difference like this is kind of like really plain but this is like more of like a bubble and then I'll do the last one and you have like something like this like little bubbles and then the ends are just kind of like this I know some people like to like curl their ends but we can just leave that but I'm gonna throw that over there so I don't see it and then we'll do this side see you have to be careful. You can pull your hair out. Oh no, Ariel. Come back. And it'll look something like this. And so for me and like my personal taste, I like to pull out some pieces around my hair. I mean, around my head. I like to frame my face. I actually don't have a lot of face framers. Most of these are just baby hairs. But I think it looks cuter. And I'll kind of just go like this, scrunch it up. Maybe, again, play with the bubbles. But yeah, that's basically it. You guys, it's super easy. And I think it's really cute. I'm not really into like piggy tails, but I think this is like a good way to wear piggy tails. So yeah, this is only my second time doing it. So sorry, I'm really bad and I'm not a good teacher, but it looks something like this. But yeah, those are my little piggy tails I like to do. I'm going to be taking an Instagram picture later. That's why I kind of did it. And yeah, that's my makeup and hair routine that I've been liking. So let's get on to the rest of my day. It is now 10.06. Oh, my video just went live. Should we go see? I forgot I had posted a video. That's quite awkward. Guys, you're just gonna have to deal with this angle. Also, it's really icy out here, so I'm legitimately... I'm slipping. Oh, My camera isn't like... I mean, my phone camera isn't the best quality, so... Wish I could take out on that camera. I don't know how to do that. Okay, anyways. Here goes nothing, y'all. Also, if my neighbors can see me, that'd be really awkward. But don't slip, Ariel. Can you guys see me? Come on, Ariel. You're not giving good vlog content. God. Guys, being, being an influencer is tough. Okay. Can you guys see me? Okay. Okay, okay. From what I've learned, other angle is better. Guys, if you just believe you can achieve your dreams, aka my dreams of going inside. Something else just landed on my head and it's cold as well. Why is this camera such good quality? Should I try taking a few shots with this? Okay, hold on, vlog. Y'all, I figured it out, but I'm too cold to do it, so we're gonna go inside. It's just, it's just too cold. I can't do it. Okay. Okay, don't slip on the ice, Ariel. Don't slip on the ice. Okay. Oh my god. It's just too cold. It's way too cold. <sighs>
You know that one TikTok that's just like when you get in the car after being with your non-K-pop friends and like you guys kind of play K-pop? That's how I feel right now, y'all. <sighs> All right, well, I just dropped off my brother. That was great. We had a great time. Just kidding. Nobody enjoyed it. Literally, we are all miserable. So, it's time for couple karaoke, everybody, and I gotta drive home. I'm, like, actually so tired, you guys. This is why Ariel doesn't need a caffeine addiction. Anyways, we should stream. What should we stream? We can stream a couple of songs that I've been really enjoying recently. No! Utility work! No! Oh, no, no. Oh my god, there's more road work. Yo! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, you guys can't see me, that's awkward. Let's get started to get you alone. Y'all, she took a dive. There was a really big pothole in the road and I and I landed on it because there was nowhere to, to avoid it. And so yeah, she took a dive. Anyways, all right, back to streaming. Well, whatever we were streaming. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
There's never a time that song does not hit extremely different. I'm going crazy. Action! Alright, we're home. Let's go inside. Guys, we got such a cool package in the mail. Oh my god, we have to open it, but I don't know where we're gonna open it because I need to find better lighting. But just for you guys to know, I just sprayed it with my handy dandy Lysol spray. I sprayed everything down. But yeah, we got such a cool package in the mail and I can't wait to open it. Alright, let's go find somewhere we can open it. Hold on. Okay guys, I think I'm gonna sit here and unbox it. But yeah, I got a really cool package from Gay's shop. They offered it to kindly send me some really cool fun things, so I'm gonna open them for you guys right now. This video is not sponsored by them in any way, but they did send these to me for free. So I'm super excited to show you guys. My dog is legitimately hacking along over here. But let's open it up. Oh my god, guys, you guys have no idea. I'm so excited. When they emailed me, I was like, oh my god, I'm so excited to work with them because these look really freaking cute. So let's see. I'll have all the links by the way down below of course to gay shop if you guys want to shop what I got Let's see also this was located in Korea. So they sent these three from Korea. They came really really quickly I will admit like super quick. Oh Guys gonna be so cute. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, first thing we have is Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so if you guys know anything about BCS, you will know that they have this thing called Tiny Ten, and they're like little animated characters of BCS. And now Tiny Tan actually collaborated to make masks, and it was super, super cool. So they sent me literally everything. They are so nuts. So thank you so much to everybody at the Gaze team. You guys are insane. But let's see what the first thing is. So the first thing, okay, these are the masks. So each member has a mask. Okay, so this one is Jin's mask. The next one we have is J-Hope's mask. The next one we have is Jimin. And then the next one we have is JK. This is super cute, oh my god. The next one we have is uh, Namjoon or RM. Then the next one we have is obviously Yoongi. And then the last one is Tete. These are so cute, okay, should we try them on? I asked for mine in a medium. They come in medium and large. And it has instructions on the back. It says, Turning inside of the mask is the front. The color side of the mask is the front. It should always face away from you. Hold the mask by ear loops and place it on each ear and adjust it to fit your best fit. Wow. All right, so obviously I'm going to keep Yoongi's for myself. <laughs> so let's check out Yoongi's. So it has the little sugar tag. That is so cute. Oh my god, I love this. It also has little words on it. So it says, I'm fine, sorry. Obviously from mic drop. Let's try it on. Yeah, it fits super well actually. This is actually super cute. The one thing I will say is though that they do not have any kind of filter or filter pocket. So I would definitely, personally for me, I would wear this over another mask. But they are really cute and like I really love the I'm fine, sorry. That's so cute. Oh my god. And it fits perfect. I was saying the medium fits me really well. So, oh my god, yes. So those are the masks. They also come with other accessories, which I'm so excited about. So let's open those up as well. We have here, ah, so each member also has a mask case. So we obviously have the J-Hope. We have Sugas, we have Jin, Jimin, JK, and Namjoon. So uh, let's open up a different member. We'll open up JK's. Where did I see JK's? All right, we'll open up JK's mask case, and we'll see the mask case. This also comes in sizes, I believe, and I got a medium size as well. Ah, this is super cute, you guys. It's like a little case. You can I'm actually going to use this when I travel to Korea because it's really handy, I feel like, to have like all your masks in one place. Super cute. So this is the medium size case, and then I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly. Yeah, so they also come with large size cases as well. I'll open that one up for comparison. So I also did get all of the <laughs> other members large size case as well so we can see so that was this is JK's uh, medium size case let's open up Jin's where's Jin's there's Jin's. Jin's large case and these are so cute you guys I love this I'm gonna definitely give them to like my family <laughs> make my mom wear her Jimin mask <laughs> um, and then this is the larger size case I think both are really nice and again they're are really spacious for masks and stuff I'm actually gonna use these just for travel I think these cases are super cute I'm gonna definitely put my masks in here but yeah it has like a little opening 
and it has the little, wow, this is actually really convenient. I actually really needed a lot of these, so oh my god, thank you so much again. One of the really cool features that the pouchy has is it comes with this little pack, which is actually to absorb like the moisture in your mask. Basically what you do is you lay your mask out and then you leave the, this pouch with the beads in it and then you put it in the pouch and basically when the beads turn from orange to green, it means that it's being saturated and you can actually reuse this little thing as long as you put it in the microwave or you just leave it to dry until the orange the beads turn orange again. So it's really good that you can actually like get the moisture out of your mask, which is a super, super cool um, and interesting design. So yeah, they actually they have that, so super cool. But the thing that I'm really excited about is they actually come with mask straps. Now, if you guys don't know what a mask strap is, it's basically something that holds up your mask. And I've been really wanting to get one, but when uh, Gaze contacted me, I was like, Yes, I need that. <laughs> so, okay, I'm obviously gonna keep Yungi's for myself, so I'm just gonna open it. Sorry I'm only opening like the Yungi Jin JK stuff, but since um, those are like my vices, I'm gonna keep those for myself and then probably give away the rest to my family that um, isn't them. <laughs> so let's open up Yungi's little strap and we have the Yungi mask that we can try on with it as well. These things are really handy, I feel like, just for like daily life. I feel like, you know, go to the grocery store, you know, having, put your mask up and down like in the car and stuff to not lose it. Ah, uh, this is so cute. Oh, I'm so excited, you guys. Y'all have no idea. Okay, let's see. It comes like this. And it has the little, oh, look at him. We have a little Yoongi's chain. That is so cute. And it says, I'm fine, sorry on it. But basically, you wear it like this, and it goes like, like this, and it holds your mask down. So let me get the mask back up, and we'll attach the little thingy majiggies to it. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my god, guys, I'm actually gonna wear this on the plane. Like, if y'all think I'm not, I'm gonna. This is so cute, and I love the little Yoongi charm. It's so freaking cute. But yeah, so like it just holds your mask like this, and then when you want to wear it, you just put it on like this, and it has the little Yoongi chain. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> oh my god, I'm legitimately obsessed, you guys. That is so cute. Oh my god, I love this. I'm actually going to use these, and I'm actually going to give them to my mom and stuff. But yeah, if you guys want to shop the Tiny Tan Gaze collab, mask merch definitely check it out i will have all of it in the description down below of where you guys can get it i know that there's a couple places that you guys can purchase them especially if you're in the u.s or abroad and not, not necessarily in korea so i'll link have everything down below thank you again so much to gaze for sending this to me you guys are so sweet <laughs> this is so cool oh my god i cannot wait to have my mom wear her jimin mask and like it's gonna be so much maybe i might give it to my mom for her birthday it'll be so funny but yeah thank you guys and i don't really know what we're gonna do the rest of the day i definitely need to do some more cleaning and stuff and some more like chilling out but since i've been out for a while i'll probably just sit here with my dogs for a little bit so yeah let's see what else we do in the rest of the day i am so happy and yeah let's get into the next part of the vlog let's go currently about to go on Instagram live because you guys know I literally go on Instagram live all the time. I'm going to pop my Instagram on the screen if you guys haven't followed me. Go follow me on Instagram. But yeah, I'm going to do like a live where I kind of just like chat and probably an online shop because I've been wanting to finish some of my photo card collections before I leave for Korea. So I think I'm going to be online shopping on like some like Japanese proxies and stuff. But yeah, just wanted to let you guys know if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, definitely do. I've just like it's honestly 2.30 p.m. I've just been laying on the couch since I unboxed um, this stuff earlier because I've been so tired and... Honestly, the doggies have been tired as well, so everybody's sleeping. We're gonna take a little bit of rest, and then I think after the Instagram live, I don't know how much else I'll vlog for today, but we'll see, so yeah. Made myself another cup of coffee, even though this is my third coffee of the day, but... It's just so necessary, you guys. Like, literally, coffee is just... Coffee is, like, there's no blood in me, it's just coffee. But anyways, alright, let's put some music on, and let's get to be talking to y'all on Instagram. Yeah, I think that's I think that's the vibe. All right, all right. Baby, baby, tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 